Shalom, shalom. Call her law, Yahweh. My heart's raising, I'm scared. Shai. By Hashem Rakakwadash, that's giving all praise to the Most High. In the name is only begotten Son, in the name of the Holy Spirit. My name is Ibar from the Prophets in Babylon, camp down here in Tampa, Florida. I want to give double honors to the elders and apostles of Great Millstone who taught us this truth and truth and sincerity, peace and salutations to the hopeful elect scattered abroad. And I'm going to title this video, You Women Are Going to Find Out That You Need a Man. Okay? You Need a Man. And this, uh, the inspiration comes from this video you see on the screen. It's from Twitter. It says, Stranger followed woman home, exposing himself. Her man was waiting. Okay? I'm going to let it play. Now, you hear her. She said she was scared. Now, imagine if she didn't have a man to scare that man off. All right. So, let's, let, let, let's go ahead and let this play with we'll grab some scripts. My heart's raising. I'm scared. <laughs> What's up, bitch? Oh, baby. Yeah, so you saw her man started chasing him down. He threw rocks at his at his vehicle and started chasing him down. But you hear her say, oh, my God, my heart, my heart is racing. I'm so scared. And you women, you know, a lot of y'all are proud and arrogant. And you ain't been in a, in a serious predicament where your life is in danger. Well, we coming into a time where there's going to be no police, no cops, no uh, 911, no ambulance, no uh, firefighters, you know, no um, men that's, risk, that's going to be willing to risk their life for you if if you are not, you know, tied to, to uh, them. So, you know, and we do these videos to warn you women, you know, just like how, how we warn, warn you men. We, and we warn all of you to repent and seek your help by your shy or you're going to be destroyed. And you women out here that's thinking that you're independent, you don't need a man. You're going to find out the hard way why you need a man, okay? And this is why the scriptures tell us to, uh, you know, um, you know uh, about the times that we're about to, to come into and to repent and to get right, you know, with your how about you shy, all right? But it says, fuck around to find out or whatever. Now, hey, even that man, he could have been, you know, if he, he threw a rock at that man's vehicle, but that man could have shot him, you know, and, and, and killed him behind that woman, you know? So women are also a liability, man. And this is also why, um, you know, when that time comes of Isaiah 4 and 1, you know, ain't, ain't no man going to want a bunch of women, okay? You women are going to find out that you need a man more than a man needs you, you know? Um, you know, especially if the if, if, if the damn woman, if, 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 if the woman is out of order, you know, she, 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 she don't respect you. She's going to be more of a liability, more of a headache than a damn, you know, than, than, than any good. You know, so let me grab this. This is Isaiah chapter 32, verse 2. It says, a man shall be a, as a hiding place from the wind, you know, which that wind is symbolic for destruction. And this woman, she went over here and, you know, she called her man. She went over here and she hid, you know, pretty much behind him. You know, she hid behind him. Now, this creep coming around the corner said he was exposing himself to her. He coming around the corner and he's, you know, looking to cause harm. He's 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 looking to. You know, lay hands on this woman, you know, and, uh, you know, probably do worse, you know. Now, had she not had a man, she would have been in serious trouble before because somebody, somebody to follow you home like this, you know, he pulled up behind her and shit, you know. Hey, man, hey, these people, these people got demons on them and these demons are, are, are going to start getting more and more bold. OK. They're going to start getting more and more bold. So even as a man, you got to be careful. You got to be circumspect, you know, understand that the days are evil. You know, pay attention. Don't be in la-la land. Don't be in your own world. Hey, pay, look around you, man. You know, and if you have women and children, then your women and children may be preyed upon and you got to be there to be a man. OK, like I said in camp last week, hey, you might have to, you know, if you a man and, and you have to defend your family, you may have to put a motherfucker down. Be ready for that. That's why you ain't supposed to have long hair, trying to be cute, you know. You know, Jake got to wear, wear the fancy shoes, spending five hundred dollars on these shoes. Like, oh, I can't crease them. Shit, nigga, you gonna be in a town where, 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 where hey, <laughs> you you gonna have to, you know, get down and dirty, man. Let me put you in a situation where you gotta get down and dirty with a motherfucker, man. Okay, it says Isaiah th th chapter thirty-two, verse two, and a man shall be a hiding place from the wind. And a covert from the tempest, as rivers of water in a dry place, as a as the shadow of a great rock in a weary land. So you women are going to find out how important it is to have a man. Okay? How important it is to have a man. 
Let's go to Isaiah chapter 32, verse 9. It says, rise up, ye women that are at ease. And these women are at ease here, man. You you know how many how many of you women are, are walking around with your ass cheeks hanging out and your breasts poking out? You know, your damn nipples, you know, protru protruding out of your shirt. You know, and then you, you don't know how many sickos are following you. You know, are following you home and seeing where you live at for, 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 for this exact day. You know, or the day when, you know, the, 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 the damn purge is a reality. And they're gonna be kicking in your door, man. You got you, you got women on OnlyFans, you know, on social media, you know, uh, making men pay to see pictures of them, and you know, they 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 they, they giving men, you know, their address to send them gifts, or to a Dropbox. They can be waiting at that Dropbox, waiting for us to pick up a gift, man. You know, a lot of stuff is going on in this world because these women have liberty, okay. But but all right now, all you have liberty to do is destroy yourself. That's that that that's what they're doing. They giving you, they giving you liberty to destroy yourself. Look at this stuff. He pulled up, you know, in the black car, you know, and then he smashes his windshield. Now, now this man could have pulled out a gun and started spraying him, man. It says, "Rise up, ye women that are at ease." And these women are very much at ease, man. You know, these women they walk around day by day, not thinking about a damn thing. They, they in their own little world, you know. La di da da da, you know. You women walk around with all this jewelry on. You walk around with, you know, a bag full of money on. You know, your purse got to go with you everywhere you go. Hey, you're going to find out that, you know, you're going to be a target, man. And and and, and they're going to want to take more than just your pocketbook. Okay, they're coming for the other pocketbook, too. They say this man was exposing himself. You got some sickos out here that are sexually deprived. And you may be a good-looking woman, you know. So you got motherfuckers that's going to be, you know, pretty much, you know, preying upon you, man. That's what this guy was doing. You know, like a damn jaguar in the, in, the, in the wilderness, you know, creeping up behind a damn gazelle, <laughs> you know, ready to pounce on her ass. It says, hear my voice, ye careless daughters. Give ear into my speech. Are you listening? How, how, now, how, now, how does the most I speak through, hey, hey, through his mouthpiece are the prophets? So we do this video is warning you of what's coming. And any woman that got some sense that you are going to consider. Those of you that, that, that ain't got no fucking, oh, yeah, nah, he just, oh, yeah, oh, my God. Yeah, okay, well, then you're going to find out the hard way then, bitch. And you're going to be, when you, when you, yeah, hey, go watch that movie, um, go watch that movie, uh, The Book of Eli, you know? That woman wanting to go go with Eli, and he was like, nah, Denzel's character, and he was like, nah, nah, stay here, whatever, yada, yada. She came anyway, you know, trying to trying to do her own thing, go her own, you know, she, well, she was trying to find him, but she went out there on her own. And she went out there on her own for about 20 minutes. And before you know it, she, she, you know, motherfucker was trying to pull her pants down, man. You know? Well, another motherfucker was, well, another motherfucker was pulling his pants down. And then in, in the movie, you know, Eli, you know, he, he shot an arrow through, 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 through the dude's ass and came out as, you know, his Johnson. You know? So imagine if you don't have a man like that to protect you in the times that we're coming into. It says many days and years, which means a, um, a, um, 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 a day above a year. So a period of time shall ye be troubled, ye careless women. For the vintage shall fail, the gathering shall not come. No more, you know, food stamps, no more um, child support, no more alimony, you know, no no, no more chivalry. Nobody going to be, you know, looking to hold a dough for your ass no more. That time is coming to an end. It says tremble. Ye women that are ease. This woman said her heart was racing. I'm so scared. She was trembling. Had she not had a man, she 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 would have really been trembling, man. The, 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 the thought of having a man and somebody to call for 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 help in a time of need, in a time of trouble, you know, I'm I'm I, I'm I'm sure that that gave her a little ease. So imagine not having a man. It says, tremble, ye women that are at ease. Be troubled, ye careless ones. Strip you and make you bare. And gird sack off upon your loins. So right now these women, I, like I was, I was in the Walmart the other day, and it was just, it was, it was just this damn woman in there. She was a damn good looking woman. I ain't gonna hold it. She was, you know, she she was she, she she was pretty. You know, she probably she she probably was, was, was a little older than I am, but she was she was pretty, and she had a fat ass booty, man. You know, so she definitely had a BBL or something. You know, she probably spent twenty racks on her ass. You know, but she was on the phone talking all loud and shit about how she just wired sixty thousand dollars to somebody. And the other day, and, and and how she sent another ten thousand to 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 a day, so you can guess, you know, she's probably a stripper or you know, OnlyFans model or something. She, but whatever it is, she is, she getting money, you know. So the Lord's about to strip you women of all that, man. These women, you know, J, hey, Jake, especially that's in the truth, man. We out here, you know, taking it day by day, you know, work, you know, working our ass off, 
you know, we, 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 we shall get our bread by the sweat of our brow. And these women, they, all they got to do is, you know, l l lay on their back in, in, in front of a camera. You know, so they have it at, they, 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 they have it at ease here, man. You know, these women ha 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 have it at ease. But the Lord is about to take all that away. He's about to strip you, you, you women of that and make you bare. You know, then you're going to find out the importance of a man. Like right now, no woman, you women don't understand the importance of a man because because it's because of the society that we're living in where it caters to women. But if you know anything about the society, it, it's about to crumble, which means it's not going to be catering to, to you, to you women for, 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 for much longer. OK. Isaiah chapter four, verse one. And in that day, seven women shall take hold of one man. And we will eat our own bread and wear our own apparel. Only let us be called by thy name. So nowadays, you women say, "Well, I ain't sharing, oh man, I ain't sharing, oh man." Which is that? Yeah, yeah, that's lawful, man. There's more women on earth than there are men. So if every woman was to get a husband, you gonna have to share. But you too pride and arrogant. Oh, I ain't sharing, oh man, I ain't sharing, oh man. Well, guess what? You actually gonna have a man. Hey, and I, I and I, I told a woman the other day. I said, uh, I told her ass. I said, you know. Um, if you want a man, cause you know, imagine you live in a fucking hood. It, it, it's a bunch of niggas out there uh, on, on the street. I saw a nigga on the street, you know, on drugs. He was fighting the air and shit. I said, listen, man, if you want a man of value, a man of character, a man of structure, you know, a man of the Lord, you gonna share him, okay? Or you can go out there and find a fucking baser on the side of the road, you know, snorting fucking Molly or something, punching the air, and see how far that gets you, man. You know, because there's men out here, but guess what? A a every man ain't in his right mind. You know, so when, when this time comes, seven women shall take hold of one man. That's going to be one of those elect Israelite men. OK, you're going to take hold of that man and, 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 and he's going to be for your protection. You're going to know if you if you if I ain't with this man, I'm going to die. You know. Just like your, your kids, if you know, if if, if, if you go on, if you, you know, walking somewhere scary with your kids and they're going to be holding on to your damn leg because they know if they get lost and then, then, then they're going to be, you know, left to test the dangers out there. You know, so, hey, somebody can snatch you up, never to be seen again. You know, and imagine you don't got a man that's looking for you. A, 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 a lot of you women ain't, 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 ain't even cool with your family because they done try to correct you. Say somebody snatch you up and you ain't got nobody to call, man. Ain't nobody going to be looking for your ass. He says, we will eat our own bread and wear our own apparel. Only let us be called by thy names. Take away our approach, man. So you women, you got, you got to approach all that feminism, all that equality, all that thinking that you're better than the man. Hey, that's gonna come back to bite you in the ass, man. Hey, like even my 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 old woman, she has you know well well I, well I have her location, so it, it, and no matter where she at, you know I can always see where she at and and, and where my kid at, you know because I because you gotta understand what type of world that we in, man. At any moment, motherfucker, hey hey hey, you might hop in the Uber, okay? You might hop in the Uber and the Uber driver may take your ass on a different you know route than you was expecting. You got uh, uh damn sex traffickers out here. All type of weird stuff going on, man. So you women going to find out that you need a man. Okay, and a man, the Lord said he's going to make a man what? Let me make this quick. This ain't it's going to be a long one, you know. But I just want to touch on this real quick, man. Okay. Because the time we're coming into, all, all, all this cute shit going to melt away, bro, overnight. Overnight. Well, let, let, let this, they tell, you're talking about the internet going out. Let this internet go out, bro. Okay. Ain't, 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 when, when, when animal validation, you know, you, you women going to be in a predicament. It says Isaiah chapter 13, verse 11. And I will punish the world for their evil and the wicked for their iniquity. And I will cause the arrogancy and the proud to cease. And right here in America, you have much arrogancy and proud going on, you know, uh, pride going on. Not only in you, uh, w uh, you know, in you damn men, but even more so you damn women. But these men are proud and arrogant, too. That's why a lot of niggas going to be destroyed. And that's why they can't get the truth because you proud and arrogant. You know, you think you know it all. You you you, you can't humble down to learn something because you know, because 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 you want to act like you already know something. Nigga, nigga that's arrogance. <laughs> the Lord going to do going going go melt your ass here, okay? And you women be in the same spirit. It says the Lord said He will cause the arrogancy of the proud to cease and will lay low the haughtiness of the terrible. So we coming to, to, to a time of hell. Esau going 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 get turned up. You know, start killing and slaying. These Jake's two third niggas gonna be they they they, they 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 gonna let these prisoners out, and a lot of these prisoners, you know, that they, they they don't just want women, but they want man's butt. You know, you've been in prison for 20, 30 years, and all you've been getting is man butt. They gonna get out, and they gonna want some man's butt. And a lot of you men gonna be in trouble out here. You you know, it was a video one time. I I always mention it. 
a long time ago, I saw a video of some cops chasing a, a Jake down, and they chased him into a back corner, and then they raped his ass, man. They they raped him, okay? They didn't know it was a camera back there, but the camera saw them, and they pretty much held him down, and they took turns raping this man. The cops, bro. The cops. <laughs> so imagine in a time of lawlessness. Here's the point, verse 12. I will make a man more precious than fine gold, even a man than a golden wedge of Ophir, which Ophir was a gold that you found in America, which is the most precious, you know, and, um, you know, um, the most pure and, and the purest gold, you know, the Lord said he gonna make a man more precious than fine gold, which is an Israelite man. OK, these men that's pushing this truth, that's, on, that's out on the highways and hedges daily, you know, and, and this man may not be able to be on the phone with you every day and, you know, text you every five seconds and be up your ass and take you on dates. You know, every every weekend because he's too busy serving the Lord. You know, so so with that, there's gonna come a reward. You going you, when that's when we, when a time come where you need a man the most, that man gonna gonna be able to stand up boldly as a lion when everybody else is running like chickens with their heads cut off, man. Or you can go out there and get one of these niggas that's gonna give you their whole world. You gonna you gonna you gonna be their world instead of the Lord being it. You know. And then when 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 a time of trouble come, he ain't gonna be fine go. He 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 gonna be damn trash. And guess what? He gonna be screaming louder than you gonna be screaming. Imagine she had a man and she told him, "This is going on. This man is chasing me. He's following me. I need some help." And he said, "Hey, uh, uh, I can't go out. There. I'm scared. You know, I don't know. I don't know what to do. I don't know. Call, call the cops. You know, that's that. That's a lot of these men out here that, that you women dealing with go go and fucking do. You know, they, they, they gonna seek to save themselves. You, you got you got a lot. You got a lot of cowardice going on in America, man. Everybody for 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 their own damn self." You know, as soon as the opportunity arrives to get the fuck out of there, they're going to leave your ass, man. You know? You wouldn't want these drug dealers, these scammers. Them niggas don't live by no principles or, or, or no morals. When, when, when the opportunity arrives, they're going to leave your ass. All right? So, with that being said, I'm going to say, Shadow One, Parma Sharala, Baba Bar, Prince of Edipon, to hope for elect. Parma Sharala, GTA, soon. Shadow One.